Welcome to my budget grocery shopping series, Coles Australia edition. I mean, let's face it guys, living in Sydney is expensive, but in this video, I'm gonna show you how I meal prepped at less than $5 a meal for five days straight. How did I do this? Well, did you know that there's an optimal time and day to go do your shopping at Coles Australia in order to take full advantage of their weekly specials as they have literally just been put on the shelves? Did you also know that there's a way for you to get a preview of everything that's gonna go on the weekly specials list so that you can plan and budget ahead? Well, these are just some of the things that I'll be covering in this video. My goal is to empower you to shop like a seasoned bargain hunter at Coles Australia. So if that sounds like something you'd enjoy, well then grab your shopping bags because we are off to do some shopping. So let's get straight to the first important thing you absolutely need to know which is what is the best day to do your shopping at Coles and the answer is Wednesday. For you see Coles actually stocks their shelves full the night before on a Tuesday night. I'm here on a Tuesday night at around 9.30pm and as you can see lots of stocking going on so that you will find all their weekly specials freshly and fully stocked the moment doors open on Wednesday. Which means that the earlier you can get there the better. It's 9am and I am at my local Coles. And in this next part of the video, I'm going to take you shopping with me as we check out all of the freshly stocked store specials. Most importantly, I'm going to show you how I bought enough to feed myself 3 meals and a snack daily for 5 days at less than $5 a meal. I say 5 days because I usually only meal prep for Mondays to Fridays. I am a content creator which means that I'm usually out somewhere eating and creating content on the weekends. I also don't always end up finishing what's in my fridge as I might sometimes end end up going out for a weekday dinner, though I do try to keep that to a minimum. So let's start with breakfast. I'm gonna get myself some of these Uncle Toby roll oats. My favorites are these creamy honey flavored ones. I like these sachet sizes not only because they have flavors but also because it allows me to portion control and also have them from anywhere as you really only need to add some hot water. These are two for ten dollars. Perfect for breakfast. And I only really have one sachet per meal which means each box will last me for about two weeks as I usually eat out on the weekends. I also sometimes have some half boiled eggs for breakfast especially if I've worked out in the mornings. Got myself some eggs for five dollars. The cost of my daily breakfast then averages at about a dollar thirty three per meal. And for lunch I'm going to be having some wraps. I got this Simpson Pantry spinach wraps. You can get five for just $4.70. For the filling, I got myself some bags of spinach, which were about $3 each. Protein-wise, I usually like to mix it up. Sometimes I will have these John West canned tunas at their $2 each, or I will just make an omelet and place that into the wrap. But that is for days that I'm not already having eggs for breakfast. I also like to switch it up sometimes and have an omelet with a side of salad for lunch. For the wraps option, lunch will average at $3.94 a meal. I also got myself some beetroot hummus dip and sakata crackers as a snack in between lunch and dinner. The weekly special prices two of these hummus dips at two for eight dollars and the sakata crackers are two for four dollars, meaning my daily snacks are at two dollars and forty cents per snack. For dinner, I got myself two packs each of the bird's eye cauliflower rice for five fifty each and also two packs of frozen vegetables for three forty each. I also got myself some lean pork mints for six fifty and I'm going to be making some cauliflower fried rice. Honestly, it is a game changer. It is it's low carb, it's delicious and it's also super simple to make. Dinner will cost me around $4.90 a meal. But if you want to level up your budget grocery shopping, here's a tip you absolutely need to know. Did you know that you can get a preview of everything that will go on specials in advance so that you can plan and budget accordingly? Yep, you can actually find out what goes on the specials list on a Tuesday night before they formally go on the aisles on Wednesday by simply downloading the Coles app. Click on sign up and once you're in, just click on specials. And here's another hot tip, connect your Flybys account to the Coles app so that it can monitor all your purchases and let you know when you're frequently purchase items go on sale. Also, I went on a Wednesday to take full advantage of the extensive specials. However, you may have noticed that I barely bought any fruits and vegetables. That's because their fruits and vegetables go on super specials on a Friday. You can similarly find out what goes on the super specials on a Friday by checking the Coles app on a Thursday night around 10 to 11 p.m. And by this stage, you're probably rushing off to download the Coles app to plan your shopping for the week. But before you go, if you found this video helpful, informative, 
informative or perhaps even a little bit entertaining, I would really appreciate a like and subscribe. It is absolutely free to do, but it would just really help my tiny little channel out so much. I've also previously done an Asian grocery store haul and I've included in the video some of my must try items at any Asian grocery stores. I've included that video at the end of this video so that you can go ahead and watch that next. I also have plenty of Sydney based content in my Sydney playlist which I've included in the description box and also at the end of this video. I also upload every Saturday so be sure to also turn on that bell notification when you are subscribing so that you can start your weekends with me. I promise you that it'll be fun. And if you got to this point of the video, I want to sincerely thank you for your support. It truly means everything. I do hope that you have a fantastic day ahead or that you've already had a good day. As always, I will see you very soon in the next video.